A call option represents a financial contract that gives the buyer the right, but not the obligation, to purchase a certain amount of an underlying asset, such as shares of stock, at a specified price, the strike price, within a certain time frame. It's a cornerstone concept for those studying for the Certified Management Accountant CMA Part 2 exam, which focuses on financial decision making, including investments and financial instruments like options, rights, not obligations. The most crucial aspect of call options is that they provide the buyer the right to buy the asset, but there's no obligation to do so. If the market price of the underlying asset goes above the strike price, the buyer can exercise the option to achieve a profit. However, if the market price stays below the strike price, the buyer may choose not to exercise the option, limiting the loss to the premium paid for the option. Premiums. The price paid for the option is known as the premium. This cost is influenced by several factors, including the underlying asset's current price, the strike price, time until expiration, and the volatility of the asset. Understanding how these factors affect the premium is crucial for making informed investment decisions. Strike price. This is the price at which the holder of the option can buy the underlying asset. The decision to exercise the option hinges on the relationship between the market price of the asset and the strike price. If the market price exceeds the strike price significantly, exercising the option yields a profit. Expiration date. Call options have a finite lifespan. The expiration date is the last day the option holder can exercise their right to buy the underlying asset at the strike price. As the expiration date approaches, the value of the option, if it remains out of the money, tends to decrease due to the diminishing time value. Intrinsic and time value. The option's price combines intrinsic and time value. Intrinsic value is the difference between the stock price and the strike price if the stock price is above the strike price. Time value is affected by the expiration date. The longer the time until expiration, the higher the potential for the underlying asset's price to move favorably. Why learn about call options in CMA part two? For CMA candidates, understanding call options is vital for a few reasons. Risk management. Options are powerful tools for hedging against market volatility and protecting investments. Strategic investment. Learning how options work enables more sophisticated investment strategies beyond simple stock buying. Financial literacy. A solid grasp of options and other derivatives enhances overall financial literacy, crucial for any management accountant.